students today we are going to discuss about the next uh, type of topology networking topology as we already know what is a topology topology is a mechanism in which the different systems are connected or different nodes are connected to share the information to send or receive the data from one PC to another, from one source to another, from one node to another. So, this is the manner how the PCs or nodes are connected in order to receive the information in the best way, in an easy way. Or we can say, it is a process, it is a manner, it is a mechanism in which we are able to give an easy access to different nodes so that the information can be received or passed away. There are different types of uh, topologies in networking. As we know, there is a bus topology. In bus topology, there is a main line that gives us access to different nodes. For example, this is a line and this is a one type of tape here and this gives us the access to the system. And this is the next tape, this gives us the access to another system. And this is the next tape, this gives the access to the next system. But if the systems are increased, if the nodes are increased, if the devices are increased, it is difficult to send the information in a secure manner. So today we are going to discuss about another types of topology that is known as ring topology. What is the ring topology in the networking system? Ring topology is a unidirectional link. It's a unidirectional link. The data goes from one side to other PCs, to other uh, nodes. It cannot come from different P and different nodes, from different sides. There is only one way, there is only one side where from the data is transferred. Let's explain it with the help of a diagram. For example, this is a ring. Why it is called a ring topology? Because it, it is, the shape is like a ring. This is the ring and these are the different nodes connected to this ring. And the direction of the information goes from one side. That is why it is called a unidirectional link. And this is in this ring. If one PC is closed, if there is a failure in one node, the link becomes useless. The data cannot be transferred off to that system. For example, if this there is a failure in this PC, in this node, we are not able to forward our data to this PC, to this node, or this node, or this, or this. So, this becomes a big fault in the ring topology. So, there is a drawback in this topology that if one node uh, is failed, we cannot send 
the data to other nodes. That becomes a uh, hindrance to other nodes to receive the data. So, ring topology, but it is, it is very easy to form a ring topology that is uh, uh, not in the uh, usage of uh, a more cable, cable system and its installation is very easy. It does not become more expensive. So, data cannot be forwarded. It gives us easy access to every node and easy to install. These are the uh, advantages of ring topology. Uh, it is easy to install. It is not expensive. It gives us easy access to all the, all the nodes. So, this was about the ring topology. The next one is Star topology. Star topology is that type of topology, is that uh, way of connecting the devices, connecting the nodes, connecting the pieces, uh, which just like a star, looks like a star. For example, Or connected different pieces are connected to this hub, and this is the hub which. Uh, Give us the information which turns uh, further information from here to different pieces. So this is just like a star. These pieces, these systems, these nodes depend upon the hub. Uh, if the hub is strong, then the uh, transformation of data is easy and can be successful. So what is uh, this hub? Hub is the main station for all nodes. It is the main station for all nodes. It is the base station of all nodes because all the nodes receive the information from the hub. It gives access to every node. If one node or PC fail, is uh, failed, the others cannot be affected. If one PC does not work, the other PCs can uh, settle work easily. It does not affect the other. Its failure cannot affect the other. So this is the main uh, advantage of this hub topology, of this star topology. All nodes can settle function and cannot be affected by the failure of one system. And it is also less expensive. So this, uh, these were the different types of topologies, the bus topology, the ring topology, and star topology, the rest uh, will be discussed in the next uh,